Welcome to our tutorial on how to add a LinkedIn button to your email signature. Now, this is a fantastic way to provide others with the opportunity to learn more about you, create networking opportunities, and instill a layer of trust in B2B communications. So let me show you just how easy it is. All right, and here we are inside of the dashboard of ByBrand. And what we're gonna do is I'm gonna click on create from template. And then I'm gonna go inside of our new options here. And I'm gonna scroll down and I'm gonna go with this one here. Okay, so I'm gonna choose this template and that's gonna go ahead and that's gonna load it up for me. And let's go ahead and zoom in a little bit here so we can get a better look. All right, there we go. Now I'm gonna show you five different ways to link to your LinkedIn profile. Now this can be with an icon or just a text link, all right? So starting with the first option is to use a LinkedIn icon. Now this is a simple and visually appealing way to link others to your professional profile. So I'm gonna add it next to my name here. So we're gonna click inside of my name. We're gonna put a space and then we are going to add an image from the image gallery. Now, once we are inside of our image gallery, I'm then gonna click on icons. And then inside of icons, as you can see, we have a lot of different options. But for this tutorial, we're gonna go with LinkedIn. So we have this one, this one, and this one, okay? I'm gonna go with this one here. So all I'm gonna do is click on the plus symbol to add that. And we can see it was added. Now, it is a little bigger, so we're gonna click on it. And once we click on it, we can take these little blue boxes in the corners and kind of resize it however you want it to be, whatever size feels good for you. And I'm thinking right about there looks good. So then we're gonna click on it one more time and then we are going to click on insert link. Then all we have to do is paste in the link to our LinkedIn profile. So I'll insert it there and then I'll click on insert. And that's it. Now inside of our email signature, anyone can click on this button and they'll be redirected to our LinkedIn profile. Now, the second option, I'm gonna show you how to create a LinkedIn button with text only, and this is gonna be a text to link. Now, this is a subtle, but yet professional looking option. So let me go ahead and delete everything down here at the bottom, and we'll use this as our example. So I could say, connect with us on LinkedIn, all right? And we'll, we'll do no period. So we have that. Now we're just gonna highlight all of that text. And once we have all of that text highlighted, we are then going to click on insert link. And once again, we're gonna paste in our LinkedIn profile link and click on insert. Now, anytime someone clicks on this sentence here, they will be redirected to our LinkedIn profile. But right now it's kind of black and it blends in with the other text and they might not know what's a link. So we have additional options. We can highlight all of it again we can choose to change the color right here where it says text color. So we click on that and we can go with a purple or a blue. I'm gonna go with this purple option here. And when I click off of it, now it looks more like a link. Now for the next option, I am going to show you how to create a LinkedIn button with an icon at the beginning. Now this here is simply just a mix of the first two options and it creates a nice balance of visuals and text. So we will keep the same text that we just typed out, but instead we're gonna go over here to the very beginning and we're gonna put a space and then we're gonna go back to the beginning again. And once we go back to the beginning here, we are then going to click on image gallery once again. And as you guessed, we are going to click on icons and then inside of our icons, we have a lot of different options besides the first three that we talked about. We can go to dark circle and we have LinkedIn. We have dark circle outline with LinkedIn. We have squares as well with the outlines as well. So whatever preference you wanna go with, I am going to go with dark circle outline and we are gonna click on the LinkedIn option and it's gonna add it just before our text. Now, once again, it is a little bit bigger so we can obviously scale this down a little bit to fit whatever we think looks appropriate like that there. Then I can click on the icon, insert link, and put our link in there just like before. And now they can click on the icon or they can click on the link here to be redirected to our LinkedIn profile. And now let's move into the next style. So I'm gonna show you how to create a LinkedIn profile URL. This is a more direct and clear cut way to guide others to your LinkedIn page. So let's go ahead and delete everything here. 
and we're going to say connect with us on LinkedIn. Then I'm going to do a little bar and then we're just going to paste in the URL to our profile like that there. Then we are going to highlight our profile URL, insert link, and then link it to our profile URL just like that. And like I mentioned before, to show it's a link, we can highlight it and we can underline it and we can also change the color to whatever color we like. So now it's a more direct way. Connect with us on LinkedIn. Here's the link to our profile. Now, something you could do to clean this up a little bit and make it a little bit nicer is we can actually delete the www part. So we can delete that as well as the beginning of that. So it's just linkedin.com forward slash. Okay, just like that. It might look a little bit cleaner on your end. So that's an option. Now, lastly, we're going to create a button with the link in the LinkedIn text itself. So this is a sleek and more modern option that you'll see in most signatures nowadays. And it makes it clear where the link is and where it will take the viewer. So let's delete all of this again. And this is also helpful if you have multiple social media websites that you would like to link to. So you could say LinkedIn, we use a little break, Instagram, use a break, Facebook, something like this, right? And each one of these words will link to obviously the profile for that referenced social media website. So once we have that typed out, I can just double click on LinkedIn, go into insert link, and then put in my link just like that. Then I can go inside of Instagram, insert link, and then insert my Instagram link. And as we mentioned plenty of times before, I can highlight that. I can underline it if I want to, or I can just change the color to let everyone know that it is a clickable link. All right, so to wrap up, we've shown you several different ways to add a LinkedIn button to your email signature, each with its own unique advantages. Now remember, adding a LinkedIn button to your email signature is a simple way to expand your network and enhance your professional communications. So thanks for watching.